The Commission has found reasonable grounds to believe that Israeli security forces committed serious violations of human rights and international humanitarian law. These violations clearly warrant criminal investigation and prosecution, and we call on Israel to conduct meaningful investigations into these serious violations and to provide timely justice and reparations for those killed and injured. We found that 189 Palestinians were killed, 183 of them with live ammunition, and this included children, people with disabilities, journalists, and paramedics. We also found that 6,106 people were injured uh, by Israeli snipers shooting at protesters with live ammunition. By the end of the year, 122 of these people had suffered amputations. These included 20 children. The vast majority of demonstrators were not involved in any form of violence. Uh, there were women and children present. There were people having poetry readings, playing music, um, waving flags, things that can't in any way be considered to be violent. So I think the characterization of all the demonstrators as violent we wouldn't agree with. We are saying that they have intentionally shot children, they have intentionally shot people with disabilities, um, they have intentionally shot journalists, knowing them to be children, people with disabilities and journalists.